One of the best parts about being a PC enthusiast is looking forward to all the new PC hardware. When it's available. And you can actually afford it. What is going on guys? I am AJ and today we're going to be taking a look back at the ever so recent GPU shortage and how the enthusiast market sucked. So stick around and let's discuss this. If you wanted to say that the main culprit behind the shortage was due to a global health crisis, a supply chain issue, or a sudden explosion of demand, you'd be partially correct. It is in fact a combination of a multitude of factors and timing that created the perfect storm. This is a semiconductor, a variation of which can be found in almost anything electronic. Now, the first issue has to do with these, or rather where these semiconductors come from. The Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, or TSMC, is the largest chip manufacturer in the world, responsible for over 50% of the global market share. One company provides over half of all chips for the whole world. While large tech companies such as Nvidia, Qualcomm, and even Apple to name a few, design their own chips and hardware, they outsource the actual production of the wafers to TSMC. If that wasn't enough, the overall number of devices that require these chips has exploded over the last two decades. Everything from household appliances to cars is heavily dependent on these chips. And that number is only increasing. While the uptick in demand has placed TSMC in a precarious position, this alone is just one part of the puzzle. So what happens when the company responsible for making over half of the world's chips can't? That's right. Absolute f***ing chaos. Now this brings us to our second reason. The pandemic. While the immediate effects like the reduced labor force affecting supply chains are among the more obvious reasons, the sudden transition to remote work for many jobs was just as, if not more than responsible. The demand for home office equipment had seen an unprecedented spike as PCs, printers, and phones flew off the shelves. The enthusiast market was no different as now a lot of people suddenly had more time on their hands. And what do mature and responsible adults do with more time and that sweet stimulus money? Spend more time with family? Invest in your future? <laughs> God no, we spend every dime and then some on new hardware. Which leads us to our third problem, erratic spending. If the normal consumer's chokehold on the supply wasn't bad enough, OEMs across the board started to get nervous. So to get ahead of the impending supply crash, manufacturers started panic buying their chips. This would ironically and unsurprisingly help create the situation they were trying to avoid in the first place. We are now looking at our fourth problem, the surge of cryptocurrency mining. Now, this is where the fun actually begins as this is actually a two-part problem. As we all know, this is around the time cryptocurrency mining started to peak. GPUs were top-tier hardware when mining coins like Ethereum and thus were in high demand. And I don't mean for one or two GPUs, no, no, no. I'm talking dozens, if not hundreds of units were needed in order to farm enough in order to turn an actual profit. This is where the second part of the issue comes in. The scalpers. Now I did do a video highlighting the issue back in 2021, but because it was my second video ever, it was absolute crap. So I'll spare you all the torture and summarize it here. <clears throat> Scalpers By buying up already dwindling inventory, in bulk might I add, in an attempt to resell it for 3 to 4 times MSRP, this became the final nail in the coffin for many retailers, especially when groups of scalpers were making bank when selling to crypto miners. Anything less than a wad of extra cash laying around or a blood sacrifice meant that you were probably going to be left empty handed. Now, if I forgot any important details, feel free to let me know in the comments. And if you want to hear me talk more about PC-related content, feel free to mosey on over to this video right here.